What's up, homies? What it do? What it do, baby boo? Namco. 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 Welcome back to the stage of history. My goodness. I don't know who I want to play as today, but I mean... Let's do some Taki. Reminds me of the chip bag, but I mean... Also... I remember, like, fighting against Taki a few times in the previous, like, you know, playthrough. And Taki really put up a fight in each of those. Oh, shit. That was really close. But yeah, Taki was, like... Not a fucking joke at all. Also, uh, I want to talk about the channel real quick before we continue. So, normally I do video essays and my main channel is, you know, as you know, Turbo Queer. But this channel, under, you know, Sega Sakura, I'm going to be uploading more frequently, more often. I have every intention of uploading more on here, just doing pure gaming content for a while. Just some stuff happened with Turbo Clear regarding uh, fair use, copyright, and all that stuff. Some of you already know what it is, but it's a long story. I don't want to repeat it. Um, but yeah, it, it burns me out pretty badly, you know? So. What I'm going to do here is, I'm going to focus on five games. Some of them I already started playing, but for those of you who don't know, I mean, like, I, I, I mean, you know, like, th there's some games I plan on completing before the end of the year, at least, I, I want to. Oh my fucking god. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to play a new game every day. Not a new game, but a different game every day. I'm thinking like a five day of the week, you know? A new a, a game, you know? And it'll be like consistently focused on that one particular game. So right now, uh, you know, today's Wednesday as I'm uploading this. So, you're going to see this on Wednesday. You're going to see Soul Calibur on Wednesday. I've got some other titles lined up for some other days of the week. I think Vampire Chronicle is also on Thursday. And I think I've got, like, a few others that are lined up already. I also got to keep in mind, too, that, like... My upload schedule may not be as consistent as I'm trying to go for. There might be times when, like, I take a huge break from, like, recording game footage. And if I do that, like, just, just let me be, you know? Like, don't, don't be mean about it, you know? Just be like, hey, you know, take your time, you know? <laughs> I would prefer to take my time in moments like that, you know? Right on. This victory strengthens the soul of Tiki. You win! I always like, you know, playing games because, you know, and, and when you're not mad at a game, you know, I always like a game that is a challenge, but like, not bullshit. Not like so frustrating that you rage quit. I never liked those experiences. And, uh, you know, like, I'll be honest with you, I know for some people, they get a, they get a huge kick out of like, rage quitting. But for me, it's like, I, I don't, I don't like rage quitting. I don't like watching rage quit. 
I like, I mean, maybe if it involved, like, you know, somebody breaking their TV. But even then, like, I, 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 I usually don't. I, I guess it's because, like, you know, it's usually somebody who's going through some kind of mental or emotional distress. And I don't mean that in, like, in, like, a way to, to put them down or to, or to be like, haha. You know, that I would never stoop that low. No, like, I remember when I was a kid, uh, I, I was playing Sonic Adventure 2, and it was the Radical Highway level with Shadow. I, I remember, like, doing the fourth mission where you had to beat the level of the time limit, and I, I still haven't to this day, but I remember when I was a kid, I was rage quitting so much that I never picked it up again, you know? I never even tried it again. Just fuck that, you know what I mean? But at the same time, like, you know, uh, my, my ex, who um, I dated like a couple of years ago, uh, she's all, she was also a huge Sonic fan and she was able to beat that mission that I couldn't do. And I, I was I was very impressed, you know? And for me, it's like, in, in one of those moments where it's like, when people are better at video games than I am, or at any particular skill, like even music, or making videos, or, you know, giving a speech delivery, or, or cooking, you know? Like, I always appreciate when people are skillful more so than me because then I can learn from them uh, or if I, even if I can't you know surpass them or become as good as they are I can appreciate that they have a skill that is so refined you know I just think that there's like a sense of honor in like appreciating those who surpass you sometimes, you know? I don't think I've died once. I don't I don't know if I have under Taki. I mean I don't wanna jinx it, but I mean like I don't remember dying. I mean I've been talking this whole time. But now I'm like not even sure. Oh shit. Oh shit, I could have got his back. I could have like stabbed him in the back there for a minute, but I, I missed the window of opportunity there. I mean, I still won, but I mean, I feel like that was a complete missed opportunity on my part. That would have been really cool. Yeah, I don't think I've died a single time. I might be wrong. I'm clearly, you know, listen, folks, like, just because I'm a YouTuber, just because I'm some personality online, I'm not perfect, and I might say things that are wrong sometimes. Or I might even say things that are problematic. And I always welcome people to point them out if I ever do so. Like, be like, hey, that was wrong. That's not cool, you know. That's factually incorrect, you know. You know, I always welcome people to do that. But, yeah, in moments like this, I don't remember dying. But it might, it might happen now, I don't know. Fuck, fuck! Well, I guess not. That was actually a close call, but I mean... Alright, well, I mean, I, if, I, if I am correct that I have not died at all once throughout this whole thing, then I'm on a streak and I can't... I, I, got, I got a lot of pressure to uphold that streak. Uh-oh, this is not looking good. I think he's got the Yoshi. Oh my god! <laughs> got the Yoshimitsu uh, template, and I mean, Yoshimitsu's pretty. Oh wait, that's not Yoshimitsu. 
Final battle. Fight. Oh my god, it's, it's Ivy. The, it's the Ivy template. Oh fuck. Oh my god, this is this is not good. Oh Come on. One more hit. Yeah, I, I, I redeemed myself there. Yup. I feel that I have redeemed my... my ass on that one. Nice. Let's see if I can read it. Evil be gone! Taki's cry and Neki Maru bowl pierced through Inferno. Taki wielded Neki Maru at her will, which, but the faint resonance of Neki Maru along, so, <laughs> so there is no end to this. Yeah, there's no end to this fucking bullshit. And repeat her favorite line: "Demon slain." The deed is done. Okay, well, at least I was able to read that part. <laughs> All right. Well, anyway, let's go ahead. I want to. I want to see how. Wait, am I, did I rank first this time again? Did I really rank first? Wait a minute. For real? Yo, Siegfried! He's a really slow fighter, but he has like a huge fucking sword. And I... <laughs> okay, yeah, that, that came out the wrong way. Anyway, let's, let's see here. I want to see... Like, because we didn't check the, the ranking for after off last time. I don't think we did, so we have to see... So we did Ivy, that's 5th place. We did Valdo, Yoshimitsu's 3rd place. Okay, so we, every time we played this game, we have successfully gotten a faster run. And Taki is no exception. Taki is like less than 4 minutes. I have never played this game that fast. I don't know if I played, well I clearly didn't play like faster characters all the time. I mean Astroth is pretty slow. Well, anyway, I mean, thanks a lot for hanging out, and I, uh, I'll see you next time.